Hello everyone watching and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm playing a game called Net Game Adventure, which is a first person game about something. I actually don't know what it's about, but it looks pretty cool. So let's go ahead and try it out as usual. Haunted Journey. Okay, this might be a horror game, but um, yeah. So we got this cool, like, br what whatever it's called, computer browser um, selection screen here, which is pretty cool. Let's just start the game. Oh, okay. That was kind of weird for a second. Okay, we're in the game. So, welcome to Haunted Journey. That's not good. That's not good that it's haunted. Okay, we have fish here. We have a really cool aquarium. We have a lock that we cannot bypass. And we have the key that we probably need to bypass it. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Sorry, sir. Let's use it. Can I use a bear? Bro, use the, use the key, bro. thing is being difficult give me call me some slack here okay here we go so this little sliver is where i had to put the key okay okay good 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 so yeah i actually have no idea what this game is about at all like i'm going into this blind so we will see what kind of game this is all right, I actually have to turn my volume down a little bit because I don't want to. I don't want to poop my pants when I'm jump scared. You know what I mean? I'm not trying to do that today. So there's another key. Let's see here. So just gonna interact. Oh, okay. So I knocked on the. Sweet Cry 5. I can't believe there's someone else online. This puzzle takes two players to finish it, so I need your help. I need something that could fit into a square hole. If you find it, could you send it through the slot here? Oh, yeah. I know something that could fit through the square hole. Oh, yeah. But that's not TOS. I can't. I can't get into details what that is. Okay, what do I need for the square hole, dog? The eye. Um, I hear something on the on the other side. Square hole, damn. I wish my my penis was square so I can put it in there. Okay, let's try to knock on the cabinet. Let's try to look at it. It's a shelf. Okay. What about the bed? Respawn points set. There's nothing under the the table. Is there anything under the bed? No, I don't think so. So, what am I looking for here, man? Alright, so, since we can knock on stuff, let's go ahead and try out all the walls. Wait. Is this a door? Oh, wow, okay. It's a door. Um, It's so dark down here. Aren't you scared? No, I'm not really scared. Unless there's going to be a jump scare. That's just going to be my animal instincts kicking in and just making me really, really scared. Um... Okay, let's move these paintings just to see if there's anything behind them of note. Maybe they will have something of importance behind them. Since there's a there's an option of you can you know. Okay, 
Okay, so we got a... What is this? What? What is this? What the hell? Okay, I don't know what that thing is. Let's go through the door. Can we go through the door? Hold on. I'm knocking. Can't open it. Can't interact with it. I'm knocking. No one's answering. I have this thing. So, what is this? I can't knock on it. When I interact with it, it just plays a knocking sound. Wait, 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 hold on. So, I think I might have it figured out. Let's play this thing again. This thing had a knocking noise, right? Um... Okay, that was perfect. I was thinking maybe if you knock it on the door in the exact same like pattern, it'll open. Let's let's hear it again. Ah, uh, okay. Okay, that was perfect. Come on. There we go. Okay, you literally have to get it perfectly, otherwise it doesn't work. Okay, what's up with these teddy bears, man? Let's see, you can't, I don't know. I don't know what is up with these teddy bears. What is up with these coins we have to get too? Like, what's the point of them? It's not like we're buying something in this game. I don't think, at least. That would be weird if there was like some kind of shop in this game okay wait this is probably a pattern so all these bears the way they're placed on the ground is probably a key to unlock a different area let's keep that in mind we got more coins damn this game is weird man it's a legitimately weird game there's presents that we can't open or use. Uh, okay. The teddy bears are, in fact, evil. Oh, what? Um, that's kind of creepy. Can I pick it up? Where did it come from? That's a great question where it came from, bro. I feel like there's going to be a jump scare. What's this? What? Hold on. Okay, that, that's reverse audio that you need to put into a, uh, you know, an audio engine of some kind so that you can... So that you can play back, which I'm not going to do because that's too much work. Let's head into here. Bro, I'm scared. I'm not going to lie. This shit is scary. Type beat. Um, okay. Hey, guys. I can't. There's no description on them. I can't interact with them. They just look at me because they are, I forgot what it's called in video game dev terminology, but it's like the uh, transparent, some kind of object. And it always looks at you. There's like an option. I forgot what it's called, but it's that. They're basically always looking at me, bro. Okay, this game is scary officially, man. I'm starting to get scared. 
I'm trying to play like less horror games. You know what I mean? I'm trying to play games that actually have some kind of. Okay, I've been here before. I'm trying to play games with some kind of like meaning behind them. Like, you know, like good games. But instead, I'm just playing these horror games again. Oh shit! Behind you. What do you mean behind me? I need to get the. H E double hockey sticks out of here. If you know what I mean. I didn't get any square objects though. Damn, that was scary. Behind you, bro. Don't say that to me, man. Say anything but that. Say anything but behind you. I don't need. Look at this shit. Behind you. Like, sh like, shut the fuck up, bro. I don't need to hear that from you, man. I don't need to hear that from anybody. That's just the worst thing you could po possibly say to somebody. Behind you. Like. Sh just shut the fuck up, bro. I'm gonna have to go back. Crap. I'm gonna have to go back. I'm gonna have to go back to the sign just to see you behind you. Okay. Is there anything behind you? What does that what does that mean, dog? What do you mean behind me? There's nothing behind you, dude. See, I, I was expecting a jump scare. Or does that mean like behind me there's a there's a um there's a puzzle piece? Like there's a There's an answer to my to my question as to where do I get the square object. Alright, hold on. So Oh, you can pick this thing up. Okay. See, like in this game it's confusing because you it's hard to figure out like what you can do and what you can't do. That's a square rectangle? I don't know. Oh. What the hell? So the paintings have changed. Um, what? Okay. Wait, can I? Yeah, so this thing is square. If you put it, you know, diagonal or, or whatever. Okay, okay, this thing is unlocked. Let's head inside of the door. Into a new area, right? Whoa. Okay. This location is super weird. Fuck. Whoa. There's like a, a thud. The hell is that? Anyway, I was about to say Fog World vibes. The city is empty. Where has everyone gone? That's a great question, but I would be the wrong person to ask a question like that because I have no idea. I have no idea what what even this game is, bro. Let's let's um let's just go down here. There's probably stuff on these right and left sides, but for now, let's just go here. Okay, this game is very creepy. I, I will give it that. Oh. Okay. That's creepy, bro. That is creepy. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. What the hell? Suzanne? Suzanne, don't play with me like that. All right, let's let's uh, let's explore the town a little bit. This place is filthy. What has happened to the city? What has happened to the city? Okay, we got a store here. There's all sorts of food here. What do you want to eat? 
Honestly, I'm just going to be honest right now. My appetite is gone. My appetite is gone because this place is creepy as hell, bro. This is like a bad nightmare. This is like not even like a night a normal nightmare. This is a bad nightmare. A good question is why do I play games like this? I don't know. I have no idea why I play games like this. Like, I don't even enjoy playing games like this that much. They're very scary. But yet I still play them. Why? Uh, okay. Kelly. There's ghosts here, man. This city has ghosts. So, has a ghost problem. Most obviously. But we are nonetheless still here looking around for stuff. And I probably went in the wrong direction. So let's go back. Okay, you can't knock on this thing. Okay. Yeah, let's just go back. Wait, can we go up here? Yes, we can. Let's let's explore around this first area. This initial starting location just to see if there's anything here that we might have missed. But damn, son, this is a scary scary game for sure. Without a doubt. Okay, let's just go to let's just go down and back up the street and actually to, to the left. Because we have not been to the left yet. What's that? What does that say? I have no idea. Okay, what does this say? Come on. What? That's just like the sound of a can, like falling on the ground or something. Okay. Let's go here. Um. Let's look around. Let's go up. Um, okay. Let's keep going. Oh, I'm scared, bro. This game gotta be so scary. Why why do I keep leveling up too? Like I'm level 31. I don't know if this is levels or not, but they're just like a random number on the right. I don't know what it means. But it's the Oh Wait, what? Oh, come on, man. Damn it. I should have been looking under my feet when I was walking. There was just a random hole that made me fall the way down here again. I have to go back. Okay. I am back here. There is a hole here. Which I didn't see before. But I bet we have to just go here. Into this location. Um... Okay, hold on, hold on. We have a key. Very good. Oh! Let me out. Let me out, bro. This this is not funny. Don't play with me like that, dog. Don't play with me like that. Okay, this is what the hole is for. So we can just quickly go down here and proceed to the... Location of our dreams, 
which is somewhere where we have to use the key. Probably this door. I haven't even been here yet. What does it say? The city's tunnel is beyond here, okay? But where do we where do we unlock the tunnel? In here maybe? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay, okay. So let's do this. Yep. And press this thing. Can I press it? Did I press okay, I think I pressed it. And let's see if the door is open. Yes, it is. Very, very cool. So now we're going into the tunnel. Oh, come on, man. It's awfully dark in here. Where does this tunnel lead? That's a great question. I feel like I'm going to get just absolutely anus, anus raped down here. If I go any further by some like God knows what. At least there's diamonds down here. At least. That makes me feel so much better and safer. Hold on. What's this? It's a heavy steel door. Oh, you can open it. Okay. That's good. That's good that you can open the steel door. What is this? Some kind of TV thing. Man, it's really dark down here. Oh. Okay, this door does not lead to the same thing as the other one. Um, okay. Um. Man, this game is very spooky, I'm not gonna lie. Oh shit! Oh. Oh. I was waiting for something to happen. I was waiting for something to happen, man. That definitely got me. And I'm sorry if anyone watching this video got jump scared. By that, because that was scary. Late disclaimer, late disclaimer. This is a horror game. Be, be, beware, beware. This is a horror game. Don't have your headphones at full volume, please. I beg of you. Wait, what the hell? Hold on. This is also backwards audio for something. Which I don't... Which I'm not going to go through the trouble of, you know, trying to figure out what it means. Because I don't care. Do these doors close on their own? I don't know. Okay, let's go further into the tunnel. At least the door, you know, is open and we can just walk in without having to find a key. I'm gonna put like warning this game is creepy as the like as part of the description because this has to be the creepiest game I've played in a while for sure. But what are these things, man? I think I just have to collect all the diamonds. I think that's what the game is all about. I can't even imagine playing this game like when I was younger. Thankfully, I am much more desensitized as an adult than I was when I was a kid. I would not be able to come within a hundred feet of this type of shit when I was a kid. 
I would have pissed my pants so long ago. Just hearing the name of the title of this game would have made me piss my pants when I was a kid. And shit my pants at the same time. How did this get in here? Yeah, that's a great question for another day. But now I'm trying to figure out how to get the hell out of here. Let's go. Let's uh, snake back around and get all the gems. A great force pushed their home into the mountain. Yeah, too bad for them. That's life, dog. Oh, there's a well here. Oh, well. It's a village well. Is there something at the bottom? That's a great question, dude. I don't think I'm... I'm gonna be honest. I don't think I want to find out. Whatever's down there can just stay down there. I don't need... I don't need that. Whatever's in... Whatever's down there. I probably don't need it. Hold on. Did I read this thing? This is a village of many mysteries. Wait. Okay, there, I think there was a cave over, like, in this direction. Let's go check it out. This is probably the scariest village I've ever encountered in a video game. There's just something about it, man. Oh. There is a big house here. Let's see what. Oh, there's someone in the window. Okay, that's great. Okay. Hey, that's cool, man. I I I I'm cool with, you know, being friends with ghosts. Enter house. Yeah, I mean, what other choice do I have? Oh shit. I'm scared, y'all. I'm legitimately scared, y'all. I don't even know, like, what the hell I'm supposed to be doing here, man. I probably have to do a knock sequence on this door, too. Basically, I have to knock it up if you if you would That would be the politically correct thing to say But I don't know I don't know man, I'm s Oh, hey, hey man. Hey, buddy. Can I grab that eye out of your eye? Thank you So yeah, I mean yeah Hopefully, there's not going to be any more um, jump scares, but that's probably not going to be the case. There's probably going to be at least one more jump scare, unfortunately enough. Looks like I'm going to have to put a heart-shaped object into here. And what is this shit? There are three circular slots on this device. Okay. Let's, let's, uh, okay, also a diamond here that I have to put some kind of diamond thing into. The only thing I have right now is a, I guess a sphere, it's the eye. Hold on, hold on, let, let me see, there's so many rooms here, man. Uh... Okay, that's cool. That's cool. I don't even give a shit anymore. Like, I'm, I'm not a bitch. You know what I mean? I'm a man, dog. I, okay, to be honest, I recently had, like, a nightmare. 
and I didn't even give a shit. I just remember in the dream I was like, like every time you have a, anytime you have a nightmare, it's always like, um, you get this feeling of extreme fear overcome you for no reason, and there's like a a sequence of events in your dream, usually leading up to the jump scare. You can open this. No. And when you get that fear, um, that's usually when you wake up from being scared. But last dream I had, I remember I just like, fuck this shit. And I was just like, I just took it, man. I was ready to square up, dude. That, that's just a life hack for nightmares. If you ever get, if you ever have a nightmare, just square up with your with your demon or or whatever trying to jump scare you in the nightmare. Just square up, start fighting that thing, bro. That's a challenge from 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 the world to you. Is um, hold on, what heart? Um, okay. I wasn't even paying attention as to like what the. Oh, 69 at least. Hey, it's my lucky day. My lucky number day. Wait, hold up. So, let me... Hold up. So, let me go back to the individual, um, these things. And can you... Hold on. So one knock equals three big knocks. Is there one here? Yeah, there is. Hold on. So the diamond is three. One, two, three, four, five. The heart is five. The diamond is three. The heart is five. What else did we have? We had two more symbols. Was there anything in here? Oh no, that was just like the weird, the weird dude. Animals there. Hold on. Alright, um this what are the things called? Wait, let's hear that again. Four? Okay. The last thing, I don't know where it is. So wait, wait, we have Diamonds three, hearts five. Three leaf clovers or whatever those things are called, I forgot. In in cards. Um four. And then we have this thing, which I have no idea what it is, but I'm just gonna guess. So wait, hearts we have five. Hold on, my bad. Five. This thing, I don't know. This thing, uh, Four. And then the diamonds are three, right? No, that's wrong. The diamonds were three, five, four. I'm just going to brute force this one. Okay, second try, let's go. Second try, let's go. Oh, okay, we, ha we have another, another item of importance, of great importance, and we have some kind of weird symbolism going on here, this guy's turned around, let me knock on his head, he he doesn't care. Let's go back up the stairs. Okay, this goes back here. That's great. So we have two uh, orbs. Now we need one more. We need one more orb. Now where am I going to get it? I don't know. 
Because this thing has a total of three. So I'll put these in right now. Okay. And it needs one more. Now where am I going to find the last one? Hold on. Is it in the box? There was a box by the bed in one of the rooms. Let's go check it out. I just don't know how to open it because I don't have any other like keys or anything to open it. So yeah, I'm not sure. But let's go back and... Yeah, I don't know. Let's see. Can you knock on this box? No. Yes. Okay, it, it, it opened. Crap. I'm lagging, bro. I'm stuttering. I'm lagging. This game has got me stuttering, bro. Anyway, we have all three balls, and now we should be able to escape. So let's add the last ball. The door is opened and we are good to go into this weird location. Wow. That's kind of cool. Before I before I press that button, let me just collect the the crystals really quick. So I feel like I'm not going to get the chance to do that. I don't know why I need them. I probably don't even need them for anything. But let me just do this. And now we are good to go. Let's go ahead and interact with this button. Okay, there is another hallway. Let's go in it. I do not know what to expect from from this location. But it looks like this is some kind of like LSD dream emulator type of location with purple trees. And we have one interactable thing over here, which is the picture. I feel like when we interact with this picture, it's going to end the game. So let's see what happens. Oh, what? So we are inside of the... We're inside of the thing. What the hell is this? Oh shit. Oh no, oh no. Crap, crap, crap. I'm stuck in here, dude. Okay, yeah, that's it. Thank God this game ended. What did you think of my first server? What does that mean? Like this game? I like it, even though it's scary. That's why I'm going to feature it on my channel. So anyway, that's going to be it for Nets Game Adventure. This game was super cool. Very scary, indeed. A lot of very awkward silences, very creepy silences um but yeah aside from that that's gonna be it and i'll see you guys next time peace out